Hello, my friends, and welcome back. It is Monday, November 20th, 2023. I'm the Drunk Poker. That's Oreo, and it's beer time. Going back to Great Lakes again. I know I did Great Lakes last night, but I just I saw this beer in the fridge. I'm like, I haven't had this in a couple of years. And I think we were missed because we talk about Great Lakes and their IPAs and, you know, I mean, the Tank 10 stuff. And that we don't talk enough about their lagers. They have many, many types of lagers. And this is a Lagerdale, or, you know, alt beer, as it were, old Dusseldorf. 5% alt beer. Uh, they have tons of lagers. Really good. They have a fantastic, just like a straight up lager. It's available at the uh, LC, but I believe it's at the beer store too. If you're looking for a beer that tastes like a damn beer, that's what you can get yourself. And you're drinking premium beer, like really good beer, and supporting local breweries. So that's good too. But I wanted this one. I love all beers. And I don't know why I didn't pick it up last time I was there. Um, it's out sporadically here and there. And I just saw it yesterday and I thought, you know what? I need this in my life. So it's been a while. What do you think, Oreos? Oreos like, oh, you hurry up and get your beer so we can go for a walk. That's all he cares about, just going for the walkies. It's more of a stand around and then run to one other area and sit there for 10 minutes. But that's okay. So I usually, yeah, I usually don't like do two in a row from the same place. So just, I'm not that smart. I'm just like, ah, that's what we're doing now. All right, it's good. All right, let's get into it. Cheers, my friends. That's a right proper pint. Hey, buddy. It's okay. Um, right proper pint. It is very dark. Dark toasted malts. Right? Very bready. Think rye bread because there's this nice kind of noble hop spice at the back. You get notes of caramel and like chestnuts. It's just kind of, hey, nobody wants to see your butt. Not even me. Do the cats in the butts. There we go. <laughs> but yeah, that's it. Like it's that, this kind of nuttiness, this caramel, toffee bready, spicy, grassy, bitter finish. Gorgeous beer. Like, it just, it's a beautiful, beautiful pint. And it's one of those ones I think that you could, like, it's 5%, so it's good and right. It's in that, you know, normal range. I really want to call it normal. Um, and you can just order pint after pint of this. It, it does feel in that Sunday beer category for me because it's just, it's delightful to have. You know what I mean? It just has all the flavors I like about a beer, and it's still crisp. It's still crisp. I know you're crisp. <sighs> You know, it's beers like this, and I probably don't drink them enough because, you know me, I just get into the IPAs, and that's what I am. That's fine. I know who I am um, and the barrel-aged stuff. Yeah, yeah, I've got lots of that, too. But these beers make me happy. When I have them, I'm like, oh, yeah. Like, that's when, that's when I saw it. I was like, I need this. I need this in my life. I need to have more alt beers in my life. And I've got a few, so that's good. Uh, we got one coming up. We're going to do two today just because we can, all right? So my day off, back to work tomorrow, back to the five-day grind. We got this. We know if you had to go to work today, I'm with you, all right? Oreo, go boy. Cheers. Hi, buddy. I know, eh? I know. Bright lights, big city, big city kitty. 